How to identify difficulty breathing. It is important to recognize concerning signs and symptoms that tell you that a child is struggling to breathe. This is also called respiratory distress. When a child is sick, for example with pneumonia, they may need to breathe fast and work very hard to get enough oxygen into their lungs. To do this, they have to use extra muscles and they may not have enough strength to keep doing this. If they get tired of working so hard to breathe, the child is in danger of dying. This is why you will need to refer the child immediately to a health facility for life-saving treatment. John, please explain how to check if a child is struggling to breathe. Yes, I usually ask the caregiver questions. Look at the child and also listen to the sounds the child makes. Let me describe how to do each of these. Start by asking the caregiver if the child has been coughing and if they have been breathing faster than usual. Then, you will want to ask how long this has been going on for and if it is getting worse. Find out if they are drinking less than normal and if they have been very tired or are struggling to wake up. Then, look at the child for any of the following. Fast breathing, chest in drawing, especially below or between the ribs, indents or pulling in at the neck with breathing, widening nostrils when they breathe in, very tired and difficult to wake up, blue lips, pale or gray skin color. Changing position to try to breathe easier, like leaning forward or tilting their head up or back. To identify respiratory distress, you will also listen to the sounds the child makes while breathing. A grunting sound when the child breathes out is a severe warning sign and the child should be referred immediately. A wheezing sound, which is a higher pitched whistle-like noise when they breathe, also needs a referral. A barking cough, which is a low pitched sound, or if it sounds like there's mucus in the throat, can be treated at home if there are no signs of respiratory distress. All of the signs and symptoms that John has explained are worrying, and if they are getting worse or the child is struggling to breathe, refer the child urgently to a health facility. Take a look at another video on how to care for a child with a cough, especially if they have concerning respiratory signs and symptoms.